Hey guys and welcome to this new uh, Storing Photo Cards video. So yeah, we're filming the uh, what one is it? September? No, August. August. Yeah, August uh, video. So yeah, as always, let's start with twice. I am trying to film in a bit of a different angle so that there is no glare at the top row of my photo cards. Although I have to film with like my buyer crooked, so it looks pretty straight to me in the camera, but I hope it looks okay on, on the camera too. So yeah, first of all, if my voice sounds a bit hoarse, I did go to see Dreamcatcher uh, yesterday in Montreal, so that may be why. I'll talk a bit more about it when I store some uh, full cards for them later on. But yeah, first off, for twice, I think I only have one full card, yeah. I have this Sana message card, which I bought at a uh, like Geo cup sleeve event from someone there. I thought I still needed it, but uh, I didn't. <laughs> I totally forgot about it on Mercury, so I'm just gonna have an extra of that now. And it kind of sucks because like these aren't really easy to sell or anything. But yeah, I'll see what I do with it when we get there. But yeah, uh, so that's the only photo card I had for twice today, which is kind of weird. I should have a lot of stuff. But yeah, <laughs> the only other things I have are uh, bigger inclusions. So let's go to there. I have uh, one Polaroid for um, between one and two. There we go. If I end up getting the last one, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do, but I'm not like looking for it or anything i just have some templates up on my account for like trades and stuff so yeah anyways there's that i can't seem to face that but anyways and then i have some um film strip which i am now realizing do i have all the film strip hmm anyways because i just accepted a trade for one but i feel like i might already have it but it's too late because it was it was sent out but yeah anyways so we have nyan i have to scoot everything like down one okay no i think i'm still missing momo so yeah uh, so the moon should go there, but I don't have hers yet, so let's put that there for now. Then there Mina. And uh, uh, Wait, I believe this skip Geo. Geo should go there. Actually, I'm just gonna. No, I said, I would, yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say, I'm gonna leave a spot for your Momo, but I need an extra pocket for hers since this is only like. This only fits eight uh, things. Which means I have to find a new spot. But for this, I mean, I'm probably gonna get another pocket and put it there. Even though it's kind of annoying to get like a pocket just for one thing. But. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna just put this one there and we'll rearrange when I get another pocket. So, uh, where can I put this? Actually, I'm gonna need another three pocket because I have another postcard. So let me get that. Okay, so here we go. Also, I did check and I am in fact getting a Duke Nyon for the film strip. So yeah, I don't know. I might try and trade for um, Momo, but honestly, don't think many people are trading for those right now. So, anyways, let's rearrange these. I think I'm only missing like two of these now, maybe. I'm missing, uh, I think, Geo, Geo and Cheon, yeah. 
So, Sana, Gina, Nina. And I'm going to put Diana up here. Cheung would go there. But for now, I'm going to put this uh, Diana ticket. So yeah, just have one more thing to put in here and goes in this bucket. So I think I'm done with the um, poster. I'm only missing uh, Jung But like these are under priority or anything. This one got gifted to me, so yeah. Yeah, okay. So that's it for twice. I don't have a lot of stuff compared to usual, but uh, my G albums did get delayed, so I'm gonna get these later, but I should have them uh, for next month, starting for the card video. So yeah, this binary is <laughs> filling up too quick to my liking. But anyways, so let's move on to uh, Double Jason next. Okay, here we go with Double J Sun. I thought I had some non-album non stuff to put away, but I don't. It's actually just album stuff, because my uh, last of my um, pubs finally came in. So, yeah. First up, we have this Soundwave concept card. I did organize, organize all of these, so I should be good. Then we have uh, Apple Music and the Soundwave selfie card. And next page, I think the names were right, but I'm not 100% sure. But anyways, next up we have this card, which is one of my favorites. I love this outfit and it's really cute. She's doing like a claw thingy. Yeah, then we have uh, with new offline, which fits this concept. Then Apple Music 2, Nanyi 1, and is this with new? I don't think it is. I think this actually, I think this is, might be. Is this Nanyi 2? Mm, I'm not fully, I'm not 100% sure. Let me check. Okay, yeah, this, this does go here in fact. It's with new too. So yeah, I'm still missing some cards. Mostly these, these I don't like really plan on getting. But yeah, I'm gonna see if I can find them for like a decent price. But they're kind of hard to find now since it's been a while since the era happened I just noticed you could see my floor so sorry about that but it's kind of hard to reflect what i was saying because i don't remember so yeah anyways um yeah let's get to something else in this binder that shouldn't really be in here but it's the only place i could put it in so yeah i have my um artemis like other eye circle cards to put away but i don't have enough space in my um Luna binders, so I was trying to think where I could put them and I see this is the best, pla best place because the Wu Jason isn't doing much these days so the collection doesn't grow that much so yeah I'm gonna put a light circle in here and probably um, Lucent Ball too but yeah after that I'm not sure anyway so let's put away the few um, the few album cards I have. I don't think I'm gonna fully like separate these since I don't really have a template and stuff to sort them but we can like do this for now. <laughs> We're just gonna put them in at random but yeah so I have these for now and I have some pubs as well. I have Full uh, count for you sets. That's the wrong order. <laughs> uh, yeah, and the transparent ones. 
I am getting another full set of cards. I bought the full uh, like Mixtor rubber duck set because like why not? It's freaking cute and it allows me getting get more uh, inclusions since I joined for uh, pubs with inclusions. So there's that at least since the cards are a bit more expensive than what I like to pay. So there we go. And I also uh, bought some random uh, Jinsoul and Kimlip pubs here, here and there. So for now, I have this uh, Kimlip bunny card and this Jinsoul. I think this was like another Canon for You event. But I think I also have um, Jinsoul's uh, rabbit card on the way. So, yeah, anyways, for now, that's that. And oh, actually, no, I should put these on this page for now because I don't have enough pages. I mean, I do, but I don't feel like organizing fully now because I also have the like IDs and stuff to put away. So, yeah, here we go. Uh, I decided to collect like the misprints for the uh, transparent cards because it fills up my page, <laughs> but yeah. At first, I was really confused in my unboxing because I thought, like, I was thinking, is there like two versions? But the pictures are the same, same. But I think it's just like that there was like a misprint or something. So quite a few of them are like the misprint. Like this one is a misprint, but yeah. And the IDs, I don't know <laughs> why I did that, but I put them in their like uh, member color sleeve because I don't know. I thought it would be cute and I had like randomly had these sleeves in the right colors <laughs> so there we go I mean it's pretty cute why not so yeah and uh, lastly I have uh, some of these stickers I am missing Kim lips I would like to get it but I'll just wait and see since it's not a priority so there we go. So let's move on to purple kiss next. I have a few photo cards, not a lot, but they are having their comeback. They are their comeback real soon. Actually, it's tomorrow, so that's really exciting. Okay, I was supposed to do purple kiss, and I did them do them before, but I remember I have some stuff to put in the actual Luna binder. So I'm probably gonna like switch those clip ups. Sorry if it doesn't make much sense. But yeah, so I do have some Eijin stuff to put in here. I have this card from their like last uh, MMT trading card set. I had bought them. I had all of them on the way. That package got lost. So yeah, I am still missing my photo book stuff. I bought the photo book. I had the photo cards on the way with those. But yeah. Like I said, it got lost, which is very unfortunate. Why do I have two pages? Oh yeah, it was for the photo book. Anyways, for now, let's forget about the photo book. Don't know if I'm ever gonna be able to get it since it's like pretty hard, I guess. But yeah, I bought uh, all of Eijin's uh, full card and some uh, Kimlip too to fill up the page. Because why not? <laughs> and she's my second bias. I loved her pink hair. So yeah. Also, it worked out perfectly that uh, Asian's unit is with Clip. So I think it makes her really good page. And I got her iconic card with the orange. So I'm happy about that. But yeah, I'm happy to finally have these at least. These were like the easiest to be by the photo book. I know all oh, that's gonna go, but hopefully it's not too hard. But we're gonna cross that bridge when we get there. So yeah, I tried to do something interesting with the bags, but they don't look that good. Anyways, so there is that. That was a very small, small addition to addition clip because didn't have a lot. But what you're gonna see next is purple kiss if I do my editing right. <laughs> so yeah. <laughs> and while we're talking about purple kiss, something crazy happened to me uh, this era. 
I won a fan sign. <laughs> yeah, I did. Uh, I never like actually tried for a fan sign or anything because they make me nervous. Like, I'm scared of talking to people, especially idols. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, I won a fan sign with uh, Yuki. Uh, I joined like a old elder group order for a count for you, and there was like a one-on-one -on -one fan sign going on. And I didn't think I'd get it because I bought like 18 albums, which I mean is quite a, a, a lot, but it's not that many, I felt like. So I wasn't like trying or anything, but I still like put all my infos and stuff in case I'd win. I never thought I would, but I did. So I'm talking to Yuki in a week. I am really, really nervous. So yeah, I'm gonna try and practice like video calls with um, Kakao Talk since I'm not familiar with the app and yeah we'll see how it goes <laughs> but anyways I'm freaking like I'm so freaking excited since obviously Yuki is one of my big, biggest olds and yeah hopefully it goes well but we'll have to see so I always freaking mess this up I don't know how, how I managed to do that, but yeah, that's right. And then she go, then she should go there. So yeah, I've got uh, both of Dukshi's uh, Poke album card. So now I think I'm only missing uh, three cards. Yeah, two here and one here. With like the Instagram tags being messed up and stuff, it's kind of been hard to look for cards. So yeah, I'm not rushing, but. I hope eventually soon I can get them. So, yeah, I got two uh, Yuki pubs since um, there was someone having a sale um, on Instagram. And they were like $4, which is very cheap. So, yeah, <laughs> I bought these two that I didn't have yet. So, uh, let me see. I don't think I have them. Yeah, doesn't seem like I do. So, let's switch. Uh, these since these are all in the same concept but yeah i don't know if i'm gonna get any more i mean i would like to get like six maybe to fill out the other page i have but since the new era started and stuff that's gonna be put on a hold for now so yeah Anyways, for now, this is what I got, and I'm pretty happy with it, so that is that. I would have loved to have finished the photo cards before the new era, but I don't know, it just didn't happen. <laughs> so I do have the last uh, bookmark I did, so I'm done with those at least, and it was like the uh, bigger inclusions that I really wanted to collect, since the postcard I'm not too fussed about. These I really wanted to finish though, so there we go. And yeah, that was it for Popokes. Not a lot once again. Once again. So yeah. Okay, so next up is a JYP girl group. I have a good amount of Etsy stuff to put away today since I have their comeback stuff. And I also have a few uh, Kushin cards. So let's get into it. These are all the uh, itzy cards I have. So let's get into it. Every time I look at this page, I love it so much. I don't know what it is about it, but the colors and everything, I love it. Anyways, <laughs> that's not what we're uh, putting away today. We're putting away uh, Kill My Doubt. So here we go. I do have a good amount of cards. So, wait. Mm, this is the D version, so I guess that should go there. And Leah. Then Lujin. This card. Mm, I guess goes there. <laughs> I don't quite remember perfectly what what went where, but I think this is right. So yeah, D 
the only illusion card I'm missing from like the normal uh, version is this one, which is my favorite, so it's kind of unfortunate. And I'm also missing this um, Ieji. So yeah. And for the limited version, I only have one of Illusion. So I think I'm gonna put this one in here since it's like a non-selfie and there are two cards here are selfies. So yeah, and here we have the full canon for your set. I don't usually collect full pub sets for anyone but since i bought five albums it came with all the pubs and this set is really cute so i'm quite happy i got it dude why are you doing that and then i was gonna put this yuna here but now i'm not sure anymore since there's the also the like Limited versions, spe no, the special versions thing. But I think I'm gonna do it like that. I'm gonna put Yuna here and Chaeyoung's equivalent of that there, and then both of um, Illusion's card. I think I didn't pull any of them, uh, any of hers in the special edition. So I am trying to trade. We'll have to see if I manage to trade. But yeah, anyways. <laughs> uh, so. Now for NMix, I have some cards, I'm still missing, um, oh no, I have this card actually, yeah. So I'm gonna be done with this page very soon, because I did buy that card, it just hasn't come in yet. And uh, yeah, for... Um, a Midsummer Dream, I have the Athens version um, Polaroid, then I have Kujins. why did I say Kujin? I only collect Kujins. anyway, I have her uh, Forest Full card, and I have one of the Answer version. I'm actually gonna put the this one here, and I'm gonna switch the pub out there since they're in the same concept. And I'm gonna put her other uh, answer version in the middle. So yeah, I'm only missing two cards, which is good. I collected this quicker than uh, the last era, which I'm happy about. But yeah, uh, I forgot to put uh, its CB Green Visions away. So let's flip back to them since we're still in this binder and put them away so i have quite a bit actually so i have some of their like member photos i'm collecting all of them since i like pull enough for my albums i am just missing um charlie young's though trying to trade for that and I also have uh, some of the bookmarks or like tickets thing also I took these out of like the um, like albums these came in all the albums but these were my favorite too so I wanted to use them as pillars so there we go and they're horizontal so it works Great for the top uh, pocket. But yeah, so I have. I'm gonna have to put white paper in here, but yeah, I have Leah and Yeji and uh, Lujin and Cher Young. I'm not gonna collect all five of them for these since I only got four and I don't really wanna buy an extra one. I wanted my top three, and then out of the last two member, the one I pulled was uh, Cher Young, so I just kept it. So yeah, there we go. That's all for this binder. Okay, this moves around a lot, but yeah, it's gonna be better when I put a uh, white paper. 
So next up is gonna be my uh, miscellaneous curl group binder. Here we go. I have to figure something out for this binder because it's way too full. <laughs> but I really don't want to get another binder. So I don't know. We're gonna have to figure it out. I was thinking of maybe taking out Wakey Makey. It would make up make a bit of space, but not that much, to be honest. Since they're inactive. But yeah, for now, there's that. Okay, what did I skip? I was I actually got something to put in the Mama Moo section, which I don't touch too often. But I bought the last uh, Mama Moo Plus album. So I have some cards to put away. I have three of them. <laughs> One of them is the dog, dog card. Yeah, those are funny. I also have this unit and uh, one of Biol's card. I'm so lucky with like my Plus album. I pulled Biol in both of the albums I bought. I mean, you have one out of two chances, chances since there's only two members, but I'm still pretty lucky <laughs> that I pulled like only Biol's. So yeah, I'm not collecting those or anything, just buying the albums for fun. So yeah, next up, we don't have any idol, but we have some uh, Le Seraphim. So I have two Unforgiven cards. I think I'm only missing one now, yeah. So I have her last uh, photo book card and one of her um, compact cards. Yeah, this one I traded for. It took her a while to come in, I don't know why. And then I bought this one for a really good price. I'm happy I have this one because it was like kind of harder to get. So yeah, that's it for Les Seraphim. Don't have a lot. <laughs> and now we have some Dreamcatcher cards, which is unusual. But like I said, I went to see them yesterday. Actually, uh, this one I was already in here, but I took it out for... To like take to the concert, so that's why it's there. Uh, what album is this card from? Oops. Okay, it's from uh, an older album, so we're gonna leave that there. And we're gonna put these. Okay, these are all from Bon Voyage, so we're gonna put this is. Uh, apocalypse save us one there i traded for these no actually i traded for i only traded for that one i think because i bought the other ones I... i'm pretty sure yeah they were like two bucks so that's why i bought them and i wanted some sweat cards to bring to the concert so yeah, anyways, talking of the concert, it was freaking amazing. It was only my second K-pop concert ever. And honestly, Dreamcatcher is a really go good group to see. Like, I don't alt them or anything, but seeing them uh, live was still so much fun. I There was only like one or two songs I didn't know since I don't know their old discography. And since we're the first show, I couldn't like know the setlist or anything because it wasn't released. But I still love and know a lot of songs from them because I do stand them, I mean. But yeah, anyways, all that to say that they were freaking amazing. Their stage presence is insane. I freaking love Sua. She's definitely my bias. I will add some doubts at some points, but now I know for sure she's amazing. And Xion also was amazing. She was bias freaking me the whole time. But I see all of them. Uh, at crazy stage presents and they were just amazing honestly <laughs> um i'm not gonna say that that i liked it more than twice because twice is obviously like my also vault and seeing them was amazing but i was a lot more like up close to the stage kind of i wasn't like right up to it i was like a few rows back but since it was a smaller theater i could see them a lot better and yeah it was insane <laughs> insane seeing them this close they were so tiny, <laughs> especially Sua, she's so small and cute. But yeah, so yeah, it was amazing. 
definitely makes me want to go to more concerts if only more people could come to Canada like they should take note and come to Canada like Dreamcatcher did like to Montreal I mean because some come to Toronto but yeah uh, although uh, Provoke is announced, just announced a tour and obviously it's only a USA tour Honestly, if they would have come to Toronto, I would have highly considered going since they're also an old, but it's only the US, like usual, so yeah. <laughs> okay, I also bought the uh, full card set from the tour because it's so cute and like I was already, uh, I already want, I cannot speak. I already wanted to buy a t-shirt, so I was in line and stuff. I didn't think there was any um, full cards left, because the March situation was a old mess. Like, some of the uh, stock got stuck to the airport. So, at like, before the show, a lot of merch, like, you couldn't get. So, I gave up on getting the full card set. Because I know some people got them before the show, but the stock was very limited. So, yeah. Anyways, it was kind of a mess. But after the show, I stayed and they were still selling merch. And they had like a, like they had a lot of photo card sets so I could get it. I'm very happy I did because they're really cute. So, here we go. Especially Anthang's card is so cute. Obviously, all of them. A lot of them were blonde, which I liked. Xion was uh, at the red hair, though. So, it really made her pop on the stage. And she looked amazing. But, yeah. <laughs> so, anyways, I'm happy that I could get the photo card set. I also got a t-shirt. There was a sleeveless shirt and a t-shirt. I couldn't choose between the two. I ended up getting the t-shirt. But I bought a sleeveless for my friend. And I kind of wish I had bought a sleeveless, too. But, I don't know. I'm not the biggest fan of sleeveless shirts because like the opening for your arms is kind of big so it goes down a lot but yeah anyways <laughs> I'm happy that I got a shirt in the end and they wore the shirt for like the end card and they look so good in it in it I would never look that good but yeah <laughs> also I love the colors it was like a green team as you can see with the backs here so yeah these are the like member cards and the group card is black so yeah, I really like the color. Anyways, that was it for my uh, Dreamcatcher segment. <laughs> I don't talk about them too often since I don't really collect them. But I've considered collecting them quite a few times over the years. And honestly, this makes me want to collect them more. I think I might just like get one copies of their albums and stuff. I'm definitely not gonna collect like fully or anything because I, I already collect way too many groups. But yeah, anyways, this was it for this binder. Now we only have... Actually, we have like three more binders to go through, which is kind of a lot. <laughs> but yeah. So we have a lot of binders to go through, but it's only like one or two photo cards. So for uh, JYP boy groups, I have one whole Strikit card. <laughs> Still trying to get the last three digits I need. It's been a bit of a struggle, but anyways, at least I have all of G-Songs, so there's that. So here it goes. This one should get to me at some point soon, not sure when, but anyways, I'm gonna get it eventually. And I actually also have two uh, Jin Young cards. I wasn't like trying to get any or any car of his cards or anything, but someone like was trading them and I had a card they needed, so I was like, why not get them? These are like way older cards though, and I don't feel like moving everything over. So I think for now I'm just gonna stick them here to be honest. Should I? Why did I leave these pots open? I'm not sure. Okay. I think I'm gonna move everything over because it bothers me, but... Yeah. Oh, actually, I know. Is this part, page, like, all marked? I think I'm gonna leave it be, like, 
mostly March. And I'm just gonna take out this Jin Young card, card and put it in here. Let's move this here, this here. Let's put this one here. So I'm just gonna separate Jing and the marks and mark cards. It makes it a bit easier for me. I don't have too much, too much. <laughs> I don't have to move uh, as much cards. So yeah. And oh no, actually, you should keep that there. And we fill this cut here. And we can put these card in here and this one here. So yeah, it's not the best setup, but it's, it helps me save a bit of space. <laughs> so there we go. That was it for this binder. Once again, didn't have much, but yeah. So last uh, big binder, we have my 17 binder and uh, SM bigger inclusions. So uh, let's see. I don't have one Dokum card today. Still trying to trade for the last two cards I need. But we'll get there when we get there. So yeah. <laughs> Gonna put this one in here. Yeah, I think that's where it's supposed to go. So there we have that. Also still trying to get his weaver set. I would love to trade my Mingao, but that hasn't worked out yet. So, okay, I have uh, also one of his bigger inclusion. And I was trying to avoid getting a another pocket, but I'm kind of thinking I should have now. Honestly, I'm just gonna put it here <laughs> and move this like on the back here. And we're gonna have to reorganize this better at some point, but not today. <laughs> so yeah, anyways, let's move to uh, EXO. I don't have any NCD to put in this binder. But I did keep my EXO solo stuff in here for now because I have, I wanted to put both of them in my A5 binder, binder but it don't fit so I'm gonna have to split EXO and NCC and I'm still in the process of trying to get other binders but it's kind of hard because I don't want to pay too much for them so yeah <laughs> anyways I have one uh, solo a seal card. Someone was selling a DDG pack for like ten dollar Canadian, like sealed, which is so cheap. Like it's the price of one of the photo cards. So I was like, why not get the album plus a photo card? So yeah, that's what we have. And I also have the poster from that uh, DDG pack. I was convinced I had a spot open for this, but obviously I don't, because why would I? Okay, so I'm just going to stick it here for now, and we're going to get a page at some point. I'm so bad at doing this today. <laughs> My head has been all over the place. I guess I'm still kind of tired from uh, Dreamcatcher, which is why I also forget forgot a car a car to put in here i have this boys b to come cards card with I, which i don't have a spot for because i wasn't planning on getting this anytime soon so i'm just gonna stick it here for now and move it later 
it must be very annoying to hear me keep saying that but that's <laughs> what we're doing today anyways let's move on to um Doyong, which should be more organized i don't i don't think you saw this yet because last month i didn't have it but i moved a document this uh small a5 binder but it's wrecked it came in really damaged so i'm not gonna keep him in here I'm gonna try and get a new one so yeah anyways first up we have a sticker card which is so exciting I wasn't even trying to get this card since it's so hard to get, but I finally did it. So it's gonna go here, and now I am done with sticker, which is freaking amazing. <laughs> I love this card so much. Obviously, it's so cute. That's why everyone everyone wants it. But I'm very happy that I got it. So next up, I have some of his perfume card to put away, and this random card, also, which. I thought I had a spot for, but maybe I don't. I think I was trying to stick it in here with like the Entity 2020 cards because it fits. So yeah. <laughs> Anyways, let's move on to Perfume. Also, their uh, Golden Age album just came out. Amazing, but I don't have it yet. So... I think I wanted to stick it here, but I'm honestly not sure. And I don't have the other cards for now, so I... No, I think actually, yeah. I think the photo book card, I was gonna put the unit, because that makes sense, so the, since it came in the photo book. And I think I was gonna put his pub with the box card. So that's where it's gonna go. Yeah, but that means... That means I should move this since it's not a photo book card. It's a digipack card, so that should go there. Yeah, and I think it's gonna fit perfectly. I think, I'm not sure, but I think so. <laughs> so anyways, also there is EXO in the back here, like their group cards. But like I said, uh, they're gonna move out, so it's not gonna stay like this. But since I procrastinate a lot, it's probably gonna stay like this for a while. <laughs> so anyways, we just have the other A5 binder to go through. Which is this little Luna binder, but it's not Luna that's inside. <laughs> so it's, um, I have some Sumi cards to put away. I ran out of pages in here. And I'm gonna switch it, switch it in another binder as well once I finally get those. But for now, I don't have it. So I just cut up some janky ultra pro sleeves i have that i don't, don't really use because i don't like them they're floppy and dirty <laughs> so yeah i'm gonna put so me uh, in those for now and yeah i pulled quite a lot of cards i bought all the versions and they all came with like two cards which is great and i was lucky enough to pull, pull like two of the special cards i think but yes, yeah, so I'm gonna try and remember what came in what version, but that may be a challenge. So, okay, first up we have the two uh, black version photo book. Those I'm pretty sure they're in the right spot. Then for the red version... I know it was this one. And like the other one was a special one. So I think it's this one, but it does it it doesn't show up very hollow. So yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna go there. And then these are the uh, Nemo version. And the jewel case. I also pulled the special for that. So yeah, I'm probably gonna store them differently when I'm, I get all of them, probably by concept. 
but yeah i love these cards so much especially the ones in this concept they're so freaking cute so yeah also the jewel case came with a concept card so that's gonna go there and yeah there was some extra cards these came in the photo book they're like playing cards vibes i guess <laughs> and there was there was these ornaments thing that came in or like keychain i'm not sure what to call them but they came in the uh, nemo version so i'm gonna put them in, in here as well so yeah anyways as usual this video was very chaotic i hope it wasn't too uh too much but i hope you guys enjoyed it and i'll see you in my next one bye